Let's look up. I'm uh, Larry Gray, and at the Archive, I'm helping Sorsha produce biographies. I got involved in the Archive through my MLIT master's program at the University of Strathclyde. I had uh, no knowledge of Alistair Gray before starting uh, at the Archive. Um, I think you can tell from my accent, I'm not from here originally, so Alistair was not originally in my sphere. My project for the Archive is helping Sorsha put together biographies for individuals r related to Alistair Gray's life, um, specifically putting together biographies that will appear on the Alistair Gray Archive website for Alan Fletcher and Liz Lockhead. The Archive has been very helpful in putting those together by allowing me to sift through correspondence and, and books and materials from Alistair Gray related to those figures, as well as um, introducing me to other individuals who knew Alistair Gray and or knew uh, Liz Lockhead and Alan Fletcher um, to interview them as well. At the uh, tail end of writing those biographies and sending them off to the people that helped me write them to, to get their final <laughs> sign off that this is good. Just sitting in this space, to be honest, and sitting in the chair that he wrote in feels like I'm almost invading his privacy, but also get to see where he came up with his ideas, which is really, really cool. I think I've learned a lot about the way he greatly loved his home city of Glasgow and the way that's represented in his work and also the way um, he took his not only his own time but his own money to promote um, the artistic endeavors of friends and other Scottish um, artistic creative figures. I think it's important preserving this space for a leading uh, Scottish um, artistic figure and and by being able to bring others into this space, they're able to see uh, the working minds of someone who's very important to Scottish creative history. From my point of view and my time by being here, there's a lot of tours conducted with students in the university and, and young artists who get to come into this space and, and I think get influenced by Alistair. He made it a mission to work with other creatives and work with promoting Glasgow and life and Scottish identity. And I think um, all those things are reflected within the archives and, and promotions they put on around and with the students and artists that the archive endeavors to work with. That's <laughs> awesome. Cool.